Well, I think most of us can agree there is nothing in the world quite like the smell of freshly baked bread. There's a place out in Portage County that's kicking that up to a special level. Techniques and a family-oriented shop, it's so good. Today, we're going behind the menu at Brimfield Bread Oven. From the time you arrive, it hits you right between the eyes when you walk in the door. The smell is absolutely overwhelming. You know you've entered someplace special. This is Brimfield Bread Oven, located in Brimfield, Ohio, in Portage County. It's a European-style wood fire bakery that's been open since 2016. Since then, it's developed an almost cult-like following in the area, offering pastries, breads, and even wood-fired pizzas. Was there a specific inspiration, a, a place that you had been to or seen where you said, wow, this is really what I'd like to recreate? Um, if there was one place that really inspired me to create something similar, it was Elmore Mountain Bread in Vermont, a, a wood-fired bakery in a couple's home. Wow. Um, yeah, and they, uh, they make fantastic bread in a beautiful wood-fired oven and are kind of a cornerstone of their community. When you're baking with live fire, there's definitely a flavor element there. Really with the bread and the pastries, you just get a really nice balanced heat from it. It's a family affair here, run by married couple Judd and Genevieve Smith, and a small staff of about 18 that has baking down to a science. I mean, I imagine we pull out like well over a thousand pieces. You know, I'm including cookies and rolls and independent loaves of bread and things like that. The bakery may be what some consider off the beaten path, but it's very much become a destination for many. I mean, it still surprises me how many people will have heard about us from a magazine or word of mouth or whatever and make the trip down from Cleveland or someplace like that too. So what, what would you say has been the big Biggest challenge for you since launch in 16? The biggest challenge? Um, Was it COVID? COVID, probably. Yeah, COVID has been a serious challenge. Um, luckily, the community was very supportive when we made some changes to our business model. We went to a curbside only pickup model where people would order uh, the days or the day before in advance, and then we would have staff members run it out to them as they arrived. Luckily, we came out okay. It was stressful, and I think, like anyone else, no one really knew how it was going to go or, well, how it's still going to go. But for now, they're staying the course, still churning out amazing pastries and baked goods and having a blast doing it. And I mean, it is a lot of work, but we have a lot of fun together and everyone is chipping in and making it happen. Labor of love? Labor of love, for sure. Yeah, for sure.